Hi guys, this is Avril Kefren. Today I'm going to show you how to increase your performance and boost your FPS in the Paragon game. And also I will show you a small tip to uh, fix the problem with the default resolution that the game can add to your, uh, to your game. So first of all, you need to click on your main drive, click user, your username, app data. To see app data, make sure you click organize, folder and search option view and show it in files folder and drive so that one is very important to see the file i will put the link in this des description of the video if you have like windows 10 or windows 8 because i'm re using uh, windows 7 right now so you will see how to uh, show all your file on your computer click app data local searching for orion game over there after that you will probably see more file but i just like hide it from uh for the video it will be more simple for you guys to see where I'm clicking, so save, config, window client, and after that, game user setting. So this is the game user setting in your game, but it's a text version of it. So first of all, if you want to touch your graphic, you will change stuff over here. Resolution quality, that one is at 100. Uh, if you want to lower that, you can. You can put, for example, 90 or 80, but you will see a big decrease in your graphic quality. So if you have big problem to, to have like your 60 FPS when you play the game, yeah, you can touch it, but I you should just test other stuff before touching th that one. View distance quality, that one is, you will see a big increase, but again, it will affect maybe your performance because you will see like, not, a, not very far in the game, so maybe you should wait before touching it. But for sure, uh, if you have again, if you have some trouble with the game, you should definitely uh, lower it. Uh, just so you guys know, like one is like low, two medium, three high, and I think you can use four two. Uh, and also, you can remove it if you want. That's really good. That's why I'm using this file. NTL is in quality. That one you can change it, and you will have a nice gain of FPS, and it will not touch too much your graphic. Uh, so you can maybe put two or one depending on your computer Shadow quality for me. It's not like a very important effect and you will see a big increase uh, with the FPS the uh, unreal engine 4 I don't know why but uh, it's taking a lot of resources to uh, To produce shadows so over here honestly you can put zero and you will probably gain uh, 7 to 10 FPS just with that so you should test definitely test it doesn't change the graphic of your game except you don't have a shadow but it doesn't like change the feel of the game post process quality it's more like uh like the good definition and all the post process like after that the graphic is rendered uh for that one again you can maybe if, uh if you put two to one uh you will maybe gain five to seven fps so you should definitely test it and after that texture quality and effect quality effect that one uh, you can gain a lot of fps too so again you can maybe use two or one depending on your computer and texture quality you can lower it but i didn't see like a big improvement it's maybe two uh, fps by bracket so it will really depend on your computer by the way you can see my computer in my description of uh, the, the video i'm using an i7 4790k for my cpu and my graphic card is an r9 from amd 280x so uh, my GPU is kind of my bottleneck on my computer, but uh, I can f easily run uh, Paragon at 80 and 90 FPS, so no problem with that. After that, for uh, all the pers people who have the problem that uh, after uh, resetting the game, the game just changed your resolution randomly, over your uh, last recommended screen height, normally you will see like some random um, like XXX.000, you can change it and just put 80, uh, 1080 if you want to play full HD. So just depending on your screen, uh, change the, the number over there and you will not have the problem. Also, you can make sure over here your resolution size is full HD. You can see here. Same thing with the last confirmed resolution. Make sure everything is like full HD if you want to use full HD. Uh, maybe one more thing, uh, very important. It's for a frame rate limit. So depending on your computer, you can limit your frame. If you have, I don't know, 144 hertz uh, screen, uh, you can put that at 144. You can even put 200 if you want. Uh, if, and if you have a 60 hertz screen and you don't want to use uh, too much uh, energy of your uh, GPU, uh, you can just set it at 60 and lock your frame. So that's about it. 
If you have any question, uh, you can ask it on the comment section of my video. And also, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, I have a lot of uh, information in my description video, uh, my uh, rig set, and uh, also the link uh, to show you how to unhide your files. So you maybe should just look at my description before asking the question. Thank you very much, guys. Bye-bye.